right guys welcome back to another episode of medieval dynasty so today we're going to see if we can't get this uh work shed built uh before the end of the season if not then we'll have to um do it another episode <laughs> but uh it's important to get it up and running and everything set up now I'm not sure how much it's going to cost for all of the different parts. Um, I do have some wood here. Uh, 6 and 20, but I have a feeling that's not going to be enough. So we're going to need to go ahead and chop down a lot more trees and uh, see if we can't get um, enough wood for that. Uh, I, I figure it's... I can't remember exactly how much one wall is. One wall actually uh, consists of uh, how many logs, but I think it's around four to six, if I remember correctly. So if we look at how many, well, it could be actually eight as well. I can't really remember. So we'll we'll take it as eight, and we'll say one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and I think those ones are 4, so we'll say 14 um, times 8, so I'm not good with math, so I'll just use a calculator. 14 times 8 is 122 logs we're going to need not including the ones for the roof so that's probably going to be planks most likely but um we should have enough in storage at the moment so we need at least 112 in order to finish that project so let's get to work and we'll see if we can't get uh, all the wood that we need today so there's some stuff in my inventory that i should probably put away as well like the um bars while we're over there we'll do that there's a lot of wood over there, so... Okay, I'm gonna put down the hammer, actually. We don't need that on us right at the moment. And we'll equip that. Alrighty then, let's go to chopping down some stuff. Put that sorted out. Oh, and it's the last day of the season as well, so... We'll be turning into summer pretty soon, so farming and all that other stuff as well. So, we might not be able to finish the um, project today, maybe not even tomorrow, last episode, but uh, we'll, we'll, we'll aim for it uh, regardless, so. 112... Uh,
Okay, so um, there was heavy rainfall and it looks like some of our crops were damaged in the process. Just a few spots, uh, not a huge number, but um, we won't, won't have a large enough yield or large as yield as we were hoping for from the oats, which is okay. We should still have a pretty good amount for the livestock and stuff like that, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, they're not eating that much, so it's like, it's not a big deal. We do have, um, all the cabbage that needs to be harvested, and we got the flax, so all that's pretty good. It's in good condition, so we'll be able to start working on that. And, um, I did get up to 60, 72, I think, uh, logs, so we're getting there. It's, we might have it done by the end of the season, so we'll see. Uh, there's 60 there, and then I put uh, the other amount here, so there's 12, so it's like 70, 72, so um, we'll have a little bit more to go, but we should probably tend, <clears throat> sorry, losing my voice, um, tend to our farm and get that all sorted out. Uh, we'll start with... Probably the flax, so we can do all the farming at, or the, um, what do you call it, the, the regular stuff at the same time. So we'll just clean up, or not clean it up, <laughs> we'll harvest all this flax and then we can start um, making, finishing some of the other projects that we needed flax for, so. Uh, I think there's some curtains that still need to be made and you know, just some general other stuff. Okay, we have to re regenerate our um, energy. <laughs> it's taking a little bit of energy to do that. We should probably invest in... Um, what do you call it? Stamina for farming? I don't know if we have any farming left to unlock, but... Might be a good idea to do... Not too worried about the durability of the items, but stamina could really help. That's a good chunk of it. Okay, so we'll continue to work on that and once we get that done, we'll harvest the cabbage and we can tell our cooks to start working on the, what do you call it, the soup or whatever it is.
Alrighty then, so I got the uh, farming done. It's all sewed and um, ready for next season, so we'll be good to go on that. And uh, now we can focus on the uh, getting the logs for the uh, storage shed, I guess. I don't know what it... I, I think it's called a storage shed. Let's quickly take a look. You can always... Take a look. Resource, resource storage. That's what it is. Not storage yet. It's basically what I call it, but I guess that's not what it's actually called. Okay, so there's a few trees that grew back. You can kind of see that by them being in the middle of the field, which is kind of funny. But um, yeah, so we'll chop these ones down and then we'll be able to continue working towards getting that. I like this little section because it's all the um, maple trees, which give four logs rather than three or two. Whoa. Should probably be paying attention what's going on. <laughs> okay, so we'll grab that. You just generally get a lot more done when you chop these ones down. like three hits for that one okay so we'll go up here and we'll start chopping down these ones not sure if these are if we start chopping down these but it looks like they're at the edge of the forest so we'll get that one chopped down and the path is right here so we'll chop this one down as well There's a few along this path as well, so we'll be able to chop these down. Okay, so that one, clean this up before we chop any more down. And then we got this one over here. Those uh, links always sound so vicious, like when the, they, they hiss and stuff, but they're really just passive creatures unless, well, Unless you attack them, I guess, but... I mean, they don't bother you when you get into their territory or anything like that. Only if you provoke them, which is actually kind of a really nice feature. Because there's a lot of animals in here in this game that really just want to kill you, so... You have the boars, um... What else is there? Wolves, those are...
All right, so I got, I think, enough logs. We got over 100 uh, logs, like 120-something or other, so um, maybe 30, uh, 36 or something like that. Anyhow, I was just uh, talking to our wife Hello. to see how our affection's doing. It's gone down a little bit. So I, I did pick up a, a gift a long time ago uh, that we can give her. Uh, we can go to, I think it's romance, and then... Uh, maybe it wasn't that one. Oh, no, it is. I got you a little something. Then we can give her the earrings. So, give gift. And that should bring it back up to 100%. So, the next time that the um, traveler person ends up at the tavern there, then we'll be able to uh, get some stuff. Or we can travel to one of the other places that have taverns. But, um, yeah. So, I think we'll be able to go ahead next episode, work on the storage shed. Uh, it looks like it's in a position that it will be able to go ahead and uh, be upgraded so we have all these uh, logs here that are 20 and then we have these ones so and then if we need to dip into our own storage we have 127 it was 129 earlier I might be going down I'm not sure I'll have to keep an eye on it um well there's not much time to keep an eye on it but um our firewood's gone up again so we'll remove some of that and throw that on the ground over here just so we can save some of the storage for now I'm trying to keep it at a reasonable amount so but uh yeah so we'll definitely tend to the storage shed we'll upgrade it and that will be next episode so if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out